an oil spill along the coastline of Tamil Nadu at Ennor. Outside Chennai is polluting several beaches, including the iconic marina, after two ships collided at Ennor's port anchorage on Saturday. Let's now go across to Sam Daniel, who's joining us for more on this. Sam, we're just looking at those pictures there. It's supposed to be a ton of oil and the damage described as extensive. That's right, Natasha. It's more than 72 hours since the ships collided at the Ennur port leading to this oil spill. And it's more than two days since the operations to mop up the area began. But still no visible signs of any change at the location where we are right now. And uh, the Coast Guard officials, with the help of a Pollution Control Board and uh, the Chennai Corporation and Fire Service uh, authorities, they are trying to use both high-powered suction pumps and also use those absorbent floating in the water there to clear this area. They have uh, removed at least 14 tons of sludge mixed with this water and uh, the impact is also spreading to other beaches in Chennai now. It, it looks like it may take at least another two days to clear the area and uh, uh, fishermen are not venturing into the sea and consumers are worried about eating fish from this area here. and. Uh, at the moment, officials say that uh, uh, once they, this, what do you see, the, the absorbents floating there, once they're able to absorb and they remove that, they'll be able to pump in more easily. Uh, yesterday, they tried suction pumps that nothing worked at the moment, and uh, around 100 people are involved, both from the Coast Guard and the Chennai Corporation. And moving away from the ground zero, here is a report on the oil spill and the kind of impact it has on the marine life and the ecosystem around Chennai. A terrible oil spill along Chennai's coast at Ennur outside the city after two ships collided at the anchorage on Saturday. The authorities say around 200 litres of oil fuel leaked into the sea. On the ground, mopping operations by the Coast Guard, Pollution Control Board, fire and rescue officials. The port has issued notice to captains of both ships for negligence. Officials say it would take at least three days for the oil to be removed. Already, there are reports of turtle dying. A lot of species are going to die, which will also affect our, uh, our coastal line of uh, fish ecosystem. I think three-fourth of the damage we're now going to see. It's only one-fourth of it that we have seen. So it is going to be going vertically right down. So that's really alarming. The damage appears extensive. Though the Coast Guard says the spill is limited to 1,500 square meters, the slick has polluted even the marina and a few other beaches 20 kilometers away. Many fishermen like Ranjit did not go fishing. At Latash Fish Outlet, not many takers, as consumers are worried. But the reports of turtle becoming a casualty because of this oil slick coming in, the big question, will this threaten the marine life around this area? In Chennai, with camera person Edwin, Sam Daniel, Find the TV.